All right then gang, so I wanna talk about one more thing when it comes to the new View CLI. And that is that just because you have the latest version of the View CLI installed, it doesn't necessarily mean that you have to stop using the old way of creating projects using view init. This way of creating projects is still absolutely fine and many developers still use this way. However, in order to use that old command view init, we need to install a bridging package globally. So if I try to use view init currently, then it's not going to work and I'll show you that. I'll say view init, we'll choose the webpack simple template and just call this test. Now, if I do this, it's going to come up with this little error that says command viewing it requires a global add-on to be installed. And it shows us how to install that right here. So if we install this, which is kind of like a bridging package to bridge the new view CLI with the old command, then we can use viewing it. So let's do that. We'll say npm install hyphen G to install this globally, then at view forward slash CLI hyphen init. So install that first of all. So once that's installed, now we can use view init. So let's try it, view init, webpack simple. And then the name of the project, test in my case. And this is now gonna create that project for you using the old command. Just gonna run you through those little questions, the project name, description, etc., And it's gonna create that project in the same way as it did before.